Welcome to our YouTube channel. Today, we'll be discussing the Chernobyl disaster. The Chernobyl disaster is one of the most catastrophic nuclear accidents in human history. It occurred on April 26, 1986, at the Chernobyl nuclear power plant in the north of Ukraine. The explosion and the following radioactive fallout not only caused environmental damage, but also resulted in numerous casualties and affected the health of thousands of people. In this video, we will explain it in four parts. The fire in Chernobyl's reactor number four was more radioactive than Hiroshima and Nagasaki combined, potentially deadly even today. The History of Chernobyl The Chernobyl nuclear power plant was built during the 1970s and 1980s in Ukraine, then part of the Soviet Union. It was one of the largest nuclear power plants in the world, with four RBMK-1000 reactors. These reactors were designed to generate electricity and plutonium for the Soviet's military purposes. Construction of the plant began in 1970, and reactor number one was commissioned in 1977. By the end of 1983, four reactors were operational. The Causes of the Accident the Chernobyl disaster was caused by a combination of factors. The design of the RBMK reactor was flawed and inadequate safety measures were taken. The events leading up to the explosion began on April 25, 1986, when reactor number 4 was scheduled for a routine shutdown. The decision was made to conduct a series of tests to improve reactor safety during low-power operations. During the tests, the plant's operators made a critical error by lowering the reactor's power too much. The experiment was supposed to demonstrate that even at low power levels, there was enough cooling capacity to prevent a meltdown. However, the sudden drop in power caused an increase in temperature, which led to a steam explosion. The explosion caused the release of massive amounts of radiation into the atmosphere. Fire and smoke continued to spread radioactive particles. The radiation release continued, and within a few hours, a plume of radioactive gas rose high into the atmosphere and spread over Ukraine, Belarus, Russia, and other parts of Europe. The Aftermath The explosion killed two plant workers immediately, and 29 more died within days. Many others suffered from radiation sickness, which caused a wide range of symptoms, including nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, hair loss, skin rashes, and burns. Thousands of people who lived in the surrounding areas were evaluated. Several towns and villages, including the city of Pripyat, were abandoned permanently. Farms, forests, and rivers in the area were all contaminated with radioactive materials. Agricultural production was severely affected, with crops and livestock becoming unusable. The radiation also had a significant impact on the environment, wildlife, and the health of the local population. The number of people who died due to the Chernobyl disaster's long-term effects is difficult to estimate, but ranges from a few thousand to tens of thousands. The Lessons Learned the Chernobyl disaster remains a significant reminder of the dangers of nuclear power. The disaster prompted the development of international safety standards and guidelines for nuclear power plants. The accident also led to a revision of nuclear regulations in many countries worldwide. Lessons learned from the disaster were used to improve the safety of nuclear power plants globally, leading to the development of new reactor designs that feature increased safety and more efficient cooling systems. Conclusion the Chernobyl disaster was the most devastating nuclear power accident in history. It caused widespread environmental damage, numerous casualties, and long-term health effects for many people. The accident prompted a complete revision of nuclear power plant safety and regulation worldwide, and many important lessons were learned. The Chernobyl disaster will remain a powerful reminder of the costly price of insufficient safety measures and inadequate precautionary measures in nuclear power. And that's it for today friends, thank you for watching this YouTube video, and we'll see you next time.